Hi everybody, Lars here from Colibrio. I wanted to show you the new uh, accessibility feature that I added. Um, it uh, was suggested to me by uh, George at Daisy, and it makes it easy for people uh, that use NVDA, the screen reader, NVDA, and, and the JAWS screen reader to add bookmarks and highlights uh, to text. And the reason we need this is because um, NVDA and JAWS do, do not scroll the documents when they read them, which means that the, uh, uh, the reading system, system app uh, very quickly loses uh, track of where the screen reader is actually uh, narrating. So to show you this, I'm going to press uh, Alt-Z, which uh, is a feature where we enter the Colibrio uh, accessibility preset. And that just turns on the scrolling. Uh, whoops. Uh, turns on the scrolling uh, view. Alert UI is in accessibility mode. Vanilla reader document. Vanilla reader document. Yes. So it turns on the uh, scroll view, so you can read an entire document at the time, and it of course boosts the uh, the font size, and it turns on the TTS. So we have uh, most of the stuff we need to uh, to make it easier for people. Okay, so I'm going to show you what happens normally uh, using a screen reader. Uh, the normal behavior is that uh, once the screen reader moves outside of the visible content, uh, it will not scroll the view. Um, what I've added is the ability for us to uh, use the virtual buffer to add bookmarks and, uh, and highlights. So. Uh, the way that this works is that we, uh, once the screen reader has moved out of the visible view, I will pause it and I will start making uh, text selection using the NVDA uh, virtual buffer. And then I will copy that into the clipboard and then I will use uh, the new feature to add uh, a bookmark and a highlight to this text. So let's start. You will have to uh, uh, listen to some, some of the text, narrated text here before I can do it. But uh, I mean, this is very good book, so enjoy. <laughs> Unfortunately, in the past, once you pushed your ebook into a distribution channel, whatever good work you had done to make your content accessible would become indistinguishable from all the inaccessible content out there to the person on the purchasing end. At about the same time that EPUB 3 was being finalized, however, the people at Edit.edu are introduced a new set of accessibility metadata for use in Onyx Records. This metadata plugs the information gap. Heading level 3 note. This guide can't possibly explain all of Onyx, nor would it be the appropriate place to do so. If okay, so already you can see that it's moved outside of the content, and uh, as de uh, application developers, we have absolutely no clue where the uh, uh, where the accessibility cursor is. So um, if you added a, a bookmark to this uh, now, at this point, you would have a bookmark for the untold story metadata heading. Um, but what you do now instead is that um, we press the uh, NVIDIA key and F9. Start marked. So now we have set a start mark for, uh, for our text selection, our NVIDIA text selection. And now we can simply just continue reading. You are not familiar with the standard. Please visit the link at EDU our website for more information. Anonyx record, if you are not familiar, is an industry standard message, XML record. That we can pause, and now I can press uh, N the NVIDIA key and F10 to end, uh, add an end mark. You are not familiar with the standard. Please visit the Edited UR website for more information. Press twice to copy or reset the start marker. Okay, so now we have a text selection, and uh, what we can do now is that we can copy this to the clipboard using Control uh, c Copy to clipboard. You are not familiar with the standard. Please... Now uh, you can use my new uh, sweet keyboard shortcuts, which I, cho I chose Alt-K uh, to add a bookmark to this specific location, and you can use Alt-Control-Shift-K to add a highlight. Let's start by adding a bookmark. So I use Alt-K. Alert bookmark added. Alert visible content has bookmarks. Press Alt plus Shift plus O to list them. Yes, and the same thing goes here if I want to uh, highlight this particular uh, point. I can. You also saw, by the way, that I, I scrolled to the location so that we are suddenly up to date with where the, uh, where the screen reader is, which is kind of handy as well. But if I want to uh, uh, highlight this now, I, uh, again, take Control-Alt-Shift-K. Alert highlight added. 
Alert visible content has highlights. Press Alt plus Shift plus H to list them. Very cool, right? And as it said, I also have a speci specific feature so you can easily see the highlights uh, that are actually visible on the screen. Heading level two highlights. Button close dialog. List close up. Selected next previous open main menu. Close menu. This guy can't possibly explain all of it. So this is what I wanted to show you, basically. It's uh, very... Uh, as I can... I mean, this must help so many people because I can't imagine you know, have what they need to endure to just add bookmarks and highlights to text. So, uh, Unfortunately, enjoy. Stop recording. 